It's time now for your primetime forecast from Dr. Don's weather page in the Shepherd's Weather Center. And this is your primetime forecast for Tuesday, May 12, 2020 on Dr. Don's weather page. Congratulations to Miss Dana Freeman. Dana was the winner of our NOAA weather radio giveaway. She went out to our YouTube page and subscribed and we drew her name out of the hat and she's the winner. Congratulations to you. Dana Freeman of Roanoke, Alabama. Your brand new NOAA Weather Radio already programmed on its way to you. And thank you for watching Dr. Don's weather page. We still encourage you to go to YouTube and subscribe to our YouTube channel. I know you can watch it on Facebook and there are several other platforms that you can watch our weather forecast on. But here's what YouTube does for you. If you'll subscribe to it, when I go live during severe weather, you're guaranteed to get a notification because their notification process is a little different from Facebook. You'll get what's called a push notification from YouTube. On Facebook, it's kind of a hit and miss as to whether or not you get notified. If you uh, are going to rely solely on Facebook, then make sure you go to your news feed settings and put Dr. Don's weather page at the top so you'll see us first. That is the best idea if you're going to stay on Facebook, but the overall best idea is to go to YouTube and click on that subscribe button. Also, folks, don't forget the 45th annual Bike Hike Stay Home Edition is underway. Bike Hike at home, at the track, on a treadmill, ride your bike, your tricycle, however you want to do it and however you want to participate. All you got to do is send in your videos and pictures to the Randolph County Learning Center. We'd love for you to send some of those to us as well. Show your signs, put them in your yard, put them on your car, wear them on your back, wherever you are. Show your support for the Randolph County Learning Center. You can give them a call at 334-863-8991 to get more information. Uh, warm up and uh, bike hike. Um, yeah, we may see a little something coming up the next couple of weeks. Kind of all depends on how this COVID-19 thing goes. Uh, so again, just call the Learning Center if you'd like more information. But it has not been canceled and they need your support this year just as much as always. This forecast also brought to you by BR Construction, Brandon Brown at 334-744-1507, Southern Union State Community College, Wadley, Opelika, and Valley. Brought to you by Joe and I at auction 431 256 252 8932 and by Neil Johnson at Superior Heating and Air Conditioning 334 646 0331. Here's the Storm Prediction Center's convective outlook for Tuesday. Nothing across Alabama or Georgia. Here's the national map showing you that we do have a big blob of rain coming this way. Then and look what happens. It runs into high pressure and gets pushed off to the northeast and will not make it into Alabama or Georgia. No rainfall across East Alabama or West Georgia in the past 24 hours and doesn't look like we're going to have any in the next several days. This goes all the way out through Sunday, though we may have a slight chance of a shower Sunday afternoon. Yeah, this graphic not showing much at all. Your temperatures across East Alabama for your Tuesday, 74 in Roanoke. We'll go to 72 in Woodland. Good water hits 76 in the afternoon. The warm spot will be down at Tallahassee, 79, and Franklin goes to 76. Here's your Southern Union State Community College live Doppler radar as of about 7 p.m. on your Monday evening. And you can see some pretty good thunderstorms up there in Kansas and uh, northern Oklahoma, back over uh, into portions of um, northern Arkansas. But again, all that's going to get turned off to the northeast as we go through the next 24 hours. This program is sponsored by Cody Yarborough at Southeast Softwash, 334-863-0084. Mr. Jimmy Stevens at Jimmy Stevens Construction, 256-610-1364. Linen Bows, Seafood, Wings, and more, 256-396-5227. Your East Alabama forecast for the next six days in the Shepherd's Weather Center on Dr. Don's weather page. On Tuesday, sunshine, 74. Wednesday, 
You got it. Sunshine, 80. Temperatures go up a tad bit each day. Thursday, 83. Friday, 83. Saturday, 86. And we may throw in a 20% chance of a scattered thunderstorm on Sunday afternoon with a high of 87 degrees. Summertime. Yeah, but look what happens next week. On Monday, scattered thunderstorms, 88. Tuesday, partly cloudy. I'll believe that 94 when I see it. Uh, but just to let you know, it is in the long range forecast. Again, folks, anything beyond three or four days, you have to kind of look at the overall pattern, not the particulars. Uh, the odds of it being 94 on the 19th are pretty slim, but it will be warm on the 19th. That's what it's telling us. On Wednesday, the 20th, yeah, they say we cool off just a little bit back to sunshine on Thursday, the 21st, and then we warm back up toward the end of the extended period. Out there on the 23rd, 87 degrees. This program is also sponsored by Rick and Becky Rainwater at Remax Lakefront, 256-610-1390. Join I at Anchor Roofing, 706-326-2438. Here's your mountain forecast for North Georgia. Partly cloudy on Friday if you're coming up this weekend. 80 will be your daytime high. Saturday, scattered thunderstorms. Sunday, maybe a scattered thunderstorm. High temperatures will be in the mid-80s. Overnight lows down in the low 60s. Great Smoky Mountains looking pretty good, too. Uh, scattered thunderstorms all three days, but I got to tell you, the chances of rain are pretty slim with high uh, daytime highs and the low 80s. Overnight lows in the low 60s. And for you folks headed to the beach this weekend, scattered storms in Gulf Shores on Friday. Sunny on Saturday, maybe a slight chance of a scattered storm on Sunday. Panama City is looking good all three days. I think maybe the commerce down there is paying off the weatherman. Sunny all three days with that daytime high averaging in the mid-80s at the beach. Jamie Dukas, your Alpha Insurance agent, sponsors Dr. Don's weather page, 256 452 5131, as well as Miss Judy Aubrey at Shepherd's Fine Jewelry and Gifts in downtown Roanoke, 334 863 2812. Folks, don't forget to catch my daily weather forecast on God's Country 90.9 FM. And folks, I'm telling you something if you want good, clean family programming that you're going to enjoy, you need to listen to this radio station. If you can't pick it up on your FM radio, then go to Dr. Don WX, that is D R D O N D X.com. Click on God's Country at the top of the page. You can go to their page on my page and you can download that Mixler app and then search for WFAZ. Listen to them anywhere in the whole wide world and you can Bluetooth your phone to your car radio and it's just like listening to the FM radio, if not better, anywhere you have Wi Fi or data connection. Also, again, don't forget to go to YouTube. You can uh, find the link to my YouTube channel at the top of this video. Click on it. Go over to the YouTube channel. Hit subscribe and like our videos over there. That helps us out tremendously, and it ensures that you will get notified the next time we go live. And there's that drdonwx.com address for you. So you can go check out our website and get that Mixler app for God's country. If you'd like to support us, all you have to do is click on that send message button at the bottom of the video or go to paypal.me forward slash Dr. Don WX. Hey folks, good Lord willing in the creek don't rise. I'll see you back in here Tuesday evening and we'll see if that chance of rain toward the end of the weekend increases. Uh, Dr. Don's weather page.